a historic night for the Blazers, but a lot of changes had to be made to actually have a night of D1 college football. COVID-19 has disrupted normalcy, but UAB put a plan together to make it work in a safe environment. The first thing you notice were the marching Blazers spaced out, taking over an entire end zone and wearing face coverings. Both coaching staffs wore masks for the entire game. Oh, UAB man, head coach Bill Clark says it was great to finally man. get over the pressures of week one. All the negativity and, you know, all our people, you know, administration, um, our coaches, our staff, our family, you know, they believed and, and um, we were able to stay safe and, and put a product out here. During the game, fans on both sides of the stadium were able to social distance seating in every other row. Despite the new normal for football crowds, the players felt the same energy down on the field. Blazer fans really showed up today, so we really appreciate that. It did feel good. They're allowed. It, it's better than we expected it to be, to be honest with you. If you ask me, I think we got the best fans in the conference, probably even in the nation. You, you see the loyalty. We had a good crowd out here tonight, and we heard them screaming all night. Week one is in the books, and game days will have a different look. But the product stays the same on the field. In Birmingham, Jared Oliver, WBTM 13. All right, and as we mentioned, it was the Blazers' 19th straight victory at home. They beat Central Arkansas 45-35. to 35.